and I'm excited today to teach you how to sell anything in the Facebook newsfeed, from t-shirts to biz opportunities, all the way to even selling real estate. So with that being said, let me jump right into it. In the next three minutes, I'm gonna show you exactly how I'm able to sell almost any product or service directly in the Facebook newsfeed, earning upwards of 333% ROI on the money I spend, using eight simple steps that anyone can follow and a little known ad strategy called dark posts. Okay, enough talk. Let's just dive right into the eight step case study. If you've got a pen and paper, feel free to take notes. This is gonna be a lot of fun. All right, step one. First, I find a high converting affiliate offer. In this example, I go to JVZoo. I look at the leaderboard for the top sellers in the past seven days. Uh, in this example here, I used Video Vantage Pro, which was sitting at the number one spot. Step number two, I review their products and their sales pages. I look at their contests, I look at their sales pages. I, I wanna make sure it's something that converts and I wanna make sure it's a product that's good with plenty of testimonials. Step number three, I split test two dark posts, at least two, to sell the product. Sometimes I'll do seven or eight or nine or 10. But in this example, you can see two that I used. You'll notice the thumbnails are slightly different. So are the, uh, the titles, the description, the links. It's all just slightly different. And that's what split testing does. It tells you what performs the best. Step number four, laser target people using custom audiences. I use a free tool called the Internet Marketing Bar. There's plenty of tools out there. Um, there's actually lots of them that I love. But in this tool right here, I do, I do searches uh, in the graph search, or I might get followers of people on pages or different groups. I'll get these audiences and I'll advertise specifically to them because this is really the bread and butter of uh, selling stuff in, in the Facebook newsfeed. Step number five, track your ad campaigns using Facebook ad reports. So Facebook ads reporting is in your ad manager. Uh, it's basically unused. People don't use this. You can save a report. I saved this one as Video Vantage. You can see I have seven posts. Half of them are running to women, half of them are running to men. You'll notice the cost per website click is about double for women and about half for men. So when you scale out a campaign, this is important to know. So just the basics. I, got, I ran about a thousand plus website clicks to this offer. My total ad spend was around $429.37 at the time of uh, at the screenshot. So step six, track your sales reports for each affiliate offer. So I log into JBZoo, look at my uh, dashboard here. The only place I ran this was on these dark posts. Uh, you can see the clicks there, about a thousand, same, same exact numbers. And my total commissions was $1,859.40. Okay, so obviously that's more than what I spent. Let's look at the numbers completely. Step seven, watch your ROI to determine how long to run your ads. Your ROI is your return on investment. So my total commissions were $1,859.40. My total expenses were $429.37 which means my total profit was $1,430.03. Now that's a total ROI, return on investment, of over 333%. This is called money flipping. And when you get the right offers and, and you're advertising this stuff, you can just flip your money all day long in the Facebook newsfeed. This is fun. It's actually pretty exciting. And listen, that's not even including cash bonuses that you might earn. I mean, I start getting uh, emails from the from the people that run these offers saying, hey, Chris, you just, you know, you just earned $200 or $500 or whatever for this offer or that offer. Because if you sell a lot, they throw cash at you as an incentive. So that's not even including this. That's the kind of fun that you can have when you're selling stuff in the newsfeed.